What it's like living in the coldest town on Earth. How to live and survive when the temperature falls below minus 60 degrees by Celsius. The extreme low temperatures are cold enough to freeze car batteries. Meanwhile, a thick fog is a constant presence in the city, giving it otherworldly aura. Why do people choose to live in a such a harsh environment? This video is about how the people are living and enjoying life in the coldest town on earth, Yakutia. Hi guys, I am Kun. I grew up in the coldest place on earth, Yakutia. Many people were asking about our daily life during the winter time. There is also a lot of fun during the winter time in Yakutia. Uh, you can do a lot of funny experiments outside and everything can be immediately be frozen. For example, the fruits can be frozen so fast so you can just use them as a hammer. And the wet clothes they freeze really fast and they become like a paper. The instant noodles they also freeze in a few minutes. The boiling water freezes in the air. Obviously, you can't just spend the, your whole life at home, especially when the winter lasts seven months. So one of the outdoor activities in Yakutia is uh, ice fishing. The people are fishing in the longest river in the world, the Lena River. They are digging a hole and just start fishing. The traditional Yakutian cuisine is also influenced a lot by our climate. And one of my favorite uh, traditional frozen dish is stroganina. Stroganina is the uh, frozen raw fish sliced into uh, thick layers. So you can just eat this stroganina with the salt and pepper. And it's so delicious. Also one of my favorite uh, frozen salads is indigirka. Indigirka is a uh, frozen fish cubes with the oil, onion, pepper and salt. It's so delicious as well. Also, in our uh, traditional cuisine, we have a frozen horse meat, a frozen raw horse liver, which is eaten raw and you need to eat it immediately. And one of the Yakutian dessert is a uh, kurchak. Kurchak it's like uh, ice cream, but made by cream and berries. Digging the wells is really expensive in Yakutia due to the thick layer of the hard permafrost. So a lot of uh, Yakutian villages no water treatment facilities, so they don't have any other option. So they're going to the lake and cutting these ice blocks for an hour. I actually tried this uh, ice water myself from the lake and it actually tastes much more better than the water from the tap. Uh, I remember when I was a kid, I was always wearing a lot of fur. Uh, like a fur coat, the hat made by folk fur, the mittens, and also the traditional Yakutian boots made by a deer fur. It's one of the must-have boots uh, during the winter time in Yakutia. I remember when I was uh, going outside, I was always wrapping my face with a scarf. And after 15 minutes going outside, my eyelashes and eyebrows is always was covered with the frost. So when you're walking around the city, you can also barely see anything around you because the city is shrouded in a frosty frog. It's actually also really dangerous if you forget your mittens at home, you can easily freeze your fingers. And I remember when I was a kid, I also freezed a lot of times my cheeks. So it's really important to wrap your face with a scarf. So that's pretty much what I wanted to talk about our uh, winter lifestyle in Yakutia. I hope you liked this video and it was interesting for you. Bye bye, see you in the next video.